Okay, my cousins, we've come back here. It's almost the end of this show. I'm really sad to go. How's the band? Clap a number there. Thank you. Got to make sure they're still working. Thank you. I feel good, bro. So good. Ladies and gentlemen, us too. I smoke James Brown. He always gets soiled. <laughs> feel good. <laughs> Something wrong there. You're going to feel good when this next guy comes out here. Yeah, my next guest is a wonderful guy. We're going to have a lecker chat. He's going to do something special for us. As you can see, he's got all funny little toys he plays with. No. <laughs> he's a fabulous guy. He's been around the world also. He does motivational speaks. Motivational speaks. <laughs> he speaks motivationally. <laughs> he does comedy. Yes, he does comedy. Just in case I got that one wrong. And his name, ladies and gentlemen, my cousins, Wolfgang Riva. Thank you, my cousin. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Oh, very good. You know, when you say to people you're a magician, there are always three questions they ask you. The first one is, can you make my wife disappear? <laughs> now I have a three-month waiting list of women who want to get rid of their husbands, okay? The second question I get is, can I change paper to money? Oh, man, I wish. And then every now and then I get the third question, which is, hey, what are you doing in my bedroom? <laughs> now, of those three, I'd like to tackle the second one. Can I change paper into money? I just happen to have an A4 sheet of paper right here. I'm going to tear it in half. Which piece may I use? The piece in my left hand or the piece in my right hand? I heard, I heard left first, okay? So you want this piece here. Okay, I'll just dump that in there. You know, I lent a friend of mine some money for plastic surgery the other day. It was really doff. Now I don't know what he looks like. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's don't get out a lot, eh? Okay. So I'm going to tell you off again which piece now, left or right? Right, I heard right first, okay. I was with my bank manager the other day. He said to me, Wolfgang, pull up a chair, sit down, relax. I said to him, no thanks, I'm comfortable on my knees. <laughs> <laughs> you know the feeling. Okay, right. So I'm going to fold this up real small like that in the cheap seats at the back. Can you see that, Joe? Okay. Now I'm going to move it up and down. The reason I do that is that you can't see what I'm doing, okay? So of course, when I unfold it again, something really weird happens. It changes into a brand new 200 rand note like that. No, no, don't, 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 don't stop. <laughs> Has anyone got a birthday today? Oh, happy birthday. Now, <laughs> now what did you think? Have any of you ever been to New York before? They have a very famous swindle they do on the streets of New York. It's called the three car trick. Chap comes up to you and says, would you like to win a dollar? We all go, yeah, and he takes you for a hundred, okay? I'd like to show it to you, not just to entertain you, but also as a friendly warning. Should you ever see it, never bet bucks on it. It's called the three car trick. However, I'm gonna show you the Irish version using four cards, okay? <laughs> you heard about the Irish chap that couldn't count to 21 unless he was naked, did you? No? Okay, right. Now, I have four large cards. You will notice that these cards are the largest cards made in this size. And the ace is the one where you put the buck on, the three blanks are there on for jelly, the Mercator mark, as they say. Okay, right. So I'm going to place the ace on top, take one of the blanks, place one of the blanks on the chair. That leaves me with two blanks and an ace. Are you happy with that? Good, it doesn't take much to make you happy. <laughs> so I'm going to put the ace in the middle, and now I cut no smokle, as they say in the cape. So watch closely. Square the cards up like this. I'm going to place a blank on top. Yes, what a nice quiet crowd to rehearse to. An ace on top, and of course also the last blank on top. So where's the ace now? Look, I'm going to do it again. This time I want you to watch properly. By the way, the more you drink, the better it gets. Okay, right, because actually the ace has been here all along. Now. I, I'm going to do this until you like it. Okay. No, 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 no. Please. A lot of people say, we never saw you put a blank card on the chair. It's a laminated blank. Are you happy with this? Good. Okay, so we place the blank there. So what's against the chair? Okay, right. Last chance to catch me out. Here goes. Oh, that reminds me. Did you hear about the short-sighted Irish circumcisionist? <laughs> he got the sack. <laughs> okay. So, we'll put the ace in the middle, okay? Square them up. This time I only do one move. I put one blank on top. Where is the ace now? On the chair. That's a blank. I showed it to you. You're not watching properly. I have one, two, three. Oh, I would have made a lot of money out of you. Oh, 
Can I do one more? Yeah, oh, of course, oh, please. Okay, right. We can now, have a chat just now. Okay, anyway. right. Now, the next trick I'm going to show you, apparently when they explained the secret of this trick to Einstein, uh, he went back to his relatives. You know, I told that joke last night. This lady laughed so much, she had tears running down her leg. <laughs> okay. Now, so it's a, it's a two with four pom-poms. Okay, a yellow one, a blue one, a white one, and a red one. Okay, now, oh, that, blue, blue, yellow, white, and red. Are you going to be next, though? <laughs> okay, right. Oh, that reminds <laughs> That reminds me, do, do you know what the difference is between pink and blue? The grip. <laughs> okay, right. So, the yellow one is connected to the blue one. I mean, there's nothing fantastic about that. But you know what intrigues me is that the red one's also connected to the blue one, okay? So these are connected as well as the host. And I mean, that's Lucas. You can figure that out. But you know what I find interesting is that logically the white one's also connected to the red one, okay? So these two are connected, those two are connected, those two there. But you see, if it would... No, 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 I'm also confused. The blue one is connected to the yellow one and the white one. But actually the blue one, if you want, is also connected to the white one, okay? Which is connected to the red one, which happens to be connected to the yellow one, which is connected to the blue one and are you following this you can even have both the same length like that I can see some of you have the same hypothesis I had when I saw this the first time but you know what freaks me out there's no string in the middle drives me crazy <laughs> oh that's the way it goes it's me the Wolfgang, sit up. You went to Hollywood and did some magic there? Yeah, and yeah. I, hate, I was there now, now and I shared a, a, a dressing room with Rackle Wells. Or there was a wall between. There was a hut in the wall. So I'm like looting through there. And I felt bad and I thought, ah, if she wants to look later. <laughs> you know, so, oh. Thank you. <laughs> You should join these eggs. No. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go away. I'm going to finish off. He's great. Wolfgang, give him a nice round of applause, folks. So <laughs> We're going to bring on our other guys here. I feel like... Now, this is the truth. I've had a request, but I'm going to stay on. <laughs> I'm going to finish with this. We're going to bring on the guys now. Okay, we're going to have a draw with the, with the, with the, with the news. We're going to bring on the guys. Come on, Mark. Come on there. Where's Kurt? There he is. Oak oh, wearing the curtains. I'm going to finish a stupid joke very quickly because I've been asked. A guy goes into a fish shop with a snook under his arm. Guy says, is that a fish shop? It's a fish shop, bro. He says, do you make fish cakes? We make fish cakes. He says, can you make one for the snook? It's his birthday tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Come stand by Please put your hands together for my guests tonight. Kurt, Mark, and Wolfgang. Okay, my cousins, we'll see you another time. Thank you so much. Thank you.